Welcome to this snapshot top 30 pair trade review. We're going to look at a, a recent trade that just came through uh, while well, this promotion has been running. And let's take a quick look at the two companies. It, the trade is VAR versus WAT. The first is Varian Medical Systems. It's in the healthcare sector, sub-industry medical instrument and supplies, 7,000 employees based in Silicon Valley, Palo Alto and they make medical devices, software products for treating cancer and medical conditions worldwide. We've paired that with Waters Corporation. That's based near Boston in, the United, uh, in uh, Massachusetts. It's got over 7,000 employees. It's in the healthcare sector as well. Sub-industry diagnostics and research, very similar sub-industries. It makes, uh, it's a specialty measurement company and it provides analytical workflow solutions based on um, mass spectrometry, uh, chromatography technology, and it does it all for the life sciences, pharmaceutical, biochemical industries. So very, very similar companies, and that's why we've paired them. Uh, you can look at the statistics. Market cap is about 15 billion on Waters, and on uh, Varian, you're looking at about 10 billion. So substantially similar companies. What happened? We got a trading signal on the 24th of October right here to sell short variant and go long uh, uh, waters which if you had been um, uh, watching the top 30 you would have immediately taken a look at and decided whether or not to trade that signal and you would have gone to the pair charts and you would see here that on October 24th there was a massive spike and it uh, closed at the end of the day at 3.46 standard deviations off of its 100-day uh, moving average of the ratio. So something big happened. You would go immediately to your news reports and your Waters Corporation. They announced results after the market closed on October 23rd. Varian also uh, announced results after the market closed on the 23rd. And that, as a result, caused that spike on the open, uh, sorry, at the close of play on October 24th. So what you would do is you would read those earnings reports, do your own analysis, and decide whether they were justified. However, you've seen that we've done the fundamental overlay in selecting pairs for the top 30. We've already got ones that are in the same uh, sector, in the same industry, or very related industry, and are, uh, if possible, market cap neutral and, uh, and beta neutral. And so you could, uh, you could say, I'm just going to go for it, or you could say, let me dig deeper in the earnings reports and see if there's a fundamental value shifting event and we recommend that you do the latter however had you taken the trade uh, the entry was here it's not a breakout on the ratio it had been higher earlier in the year and very quickly it came good so the entry 24th of october at 346 standard deviations about 10 12 days later you exited on the 14th of november uh, six days ago five days ago and uh, it closed just below the uh, moving average of the ratio and a gross profit of 906. And if you go to your trading signals, that foots with a net profit, which we have in here, of 803, which is the commissions and slippage estimate you put into your back test that have been removed. So if you had looked at the back test previous to this trade happening, this is what you would have found. Over the last three years, there were 13 trades. Most importantly, it's co-integrated at a 0 0.97, which means a p-value of 0 0.03 on the co-integration augmented Dickey Fuller test and compound annual growth rate over the last three years of 14% for capital deployed in this pair and a 9% drawdown gross profit of over 6,000 and average net profit to trade of about 362 so what you can see is this last trade uh, went quickly on side made a lot of money but came back and then went back up again and closed and you can see that here uh, this was the entry almost closed went back up and then closed so 12 days about $800 net profit. That's an example of how we do the top 30, and that's an example of the most recent trade from the updated top 30, which are available in this promotion. Happy trading, everyone.